Hi, I'm Patricia McNeely. I am a Blu-ray Twin Flame from Chicago, Illinois. In today's video, I want to talk to you about love. This is some new moon energy, but it's not just the moon. This energy is about your comfort zones. It's about love and it's about your comfort zones, what's been comfortable, what might be beginning to be uncomfortable. Is it uncomfortable if you're in a relationship, if your twin is in a relationship? And as the seasons change, because we've had a season change already, and those of us here in the Northern Hemisphere, we like to break out the heaters, right? Look at the name on this one, Comfort Zone, okay? How are your comfort zones? What have you been comfortable with and what are you no longer comfortable with? Has it been comfortable just to get together once in a while? What is your heart saying to you? What are you feeling? Where do you want to be? Where, you know, where do you know where your life is going to? Well, I do, and I'm here to help with that. So letting go of whatever might be helping you get stuck or helping you feel stuck that you don't want anymore, helping you get Helping this stagnant energy, if you feel like you're just uh, treading water, if you're just surviving, you don't know what your next moves are, I help to bring this out of you. I have the high connections that I'm gifted with that I use to help you to get things moving for you. Because letting go involves the light body. You have more than you realized. And actually, because you do have more, that means more subtle bodies, more connections, more gifts, more skills. Everyone who is a twin flame is gifted. That's a given. But sometimes sifting through things takes a little bit of skill, which I have, to try and get things shifted. It's not just by talking. It starts by talking. Tell me a little bit about your journey. Are you on a twin flame journey? Maybe you've been questioning that. Maybe it's been comfortable for you to just think, well, I'm a twin flame someday until it gets uncomfortable and you say like, well, where is that? Where is this day? Or you say, you know, I'm happy with the way it is. You're not actually not going to stay in that comfort zone either. So everyone has different types of comfort zones. It's family comfort zones, what you're comfortable with. You even have comfortable places, like if you go to a holiday dinner at family, you might have one spot where you park yourself because it's comfortable. Or you may hang out with the children because you don't want to talk to the adults, and that's your comfort zone. But when it comes to love, love will break you out of all the complacency. You may not even realize it is some sense of being complacent, status quo feeling like you're at a stalemate or something along those lines. You will get more in a one hour energy session with me than you would with months and months of months of wondering, okay? What I do is intended to expedite your therapy. I also coach people and I also teach classes. So you can either have a body session, energy body session, the causal body session, or join one of my ongoing webinars. I have several webinars that are already pre-recorded with different subjects. Some of them are about gathering in your love. Some of them are about the mental and emotional body. They all have to do with your light body. I have some on divorce. What do you do? Because your divine marriage is really where the true comforts lie. How do you start to get things shifted? Now, there's a lot of talk about union, but union involves the unification of your subtle bodies. That's also what I help with in a one-hour energy session of some kind. That's what we do. We get it moving. We get it shifted. We start propelling you in the upward mobile direction that you need to be in and your twin with you. Because if you have ever wondered, how am I going to say this? How am I, when are they going to? You do it through you. You don't need to double up. One of you does it and wish it. Do it. 
take the plunge. Get out of your own comfort zone of just, you know, watching video after video and actually do something. The people I've worked with have actually had some amazing results. It's all very specific for them. And it does involve getting things to a level where it feels lighter. It doesn't have quite the same heaviness. And you learn. Because with every session, I talk to you about you, and I talk to you about your twin flame. Now, just a couple other things to mention. I will be on a TV show on October 15th called Inner Quest. It's here in Chicago. It's a local show. I was invited by the Infinity Foundation. I will be demonstrating live, and I'll be getting a recording of that. So if you want to see what I have to say, here's an amazing thing, ladies and gentlemen. Twin flames feel so big. But I've had to break out of my own comfort zones. Some of those involved telling people what it is I do for a living. So when people say, what do you do? I'll say things to them such as, well, if someone has a toxic relationship, I help them remove the toxins from whatever caused that relationship. If they're going through a breakup, I help them shift that. It goes beyond coaching, but it does include coaching because the coaching is done with guidance. It's specific to that person. I recently had uh, some people where they said to me, well, what do you, you know, what do you do? Okay, it is energy work. I work with the subtle bodies. I can feel and sense, and I've been trained in the subtle bodies and the human body. So I started with the human body really as a late teen. I started with massage, and you could say I kind of learned this backwards because I learned how energies feel with the body, and hence, I also subsequently not only learned about my own channels, I teach people how to get their channels open and maintain a higher awakened state. I teach people how to get back to sleep at night if you are having sleep issues without medicines. Your body is intended to eventually to be without medicines, without chronic illness, or managing that. It starts with your energy, and it really it starts with the love. So if you've not really been certain, take the plunge. I guarantee you will come away with feeling good. The comfort zones are on multiple levels. We've all had a comfort in 3D. It's the comfort of being around a campfire, you know, surviving when the hunt is over and you're sitting there, you know, chewing on some something and you're sitting with others from your tribe. That's a 3D comfort zone. A 4D comfort zone. This might be a ritual that has worked for a lot of people, like a group of people. But maybe it doesn't feel so comfortable anymore. 5D comfort zones. Being able to use your hands to create some magic and it's not working for you right here, right now. How do you get to the level of working your magic for the goddess or god of your union that you are? You're a lover. And so some of these comfort zones are different for different people. But they are always going to be where you might level off in there and then the universe gives you a push. Are you feeling pushed by what seems like the universe? Possibly. Also, I will be in California for the 26th to the 29th teaching what it is that I do. I'm going to teach initial teaching. That's also me breaking out of my comfort zone. Do I want to get on a plane to go to California? That may sound glamorous to some people. I have not been to Los Angeles. I've been to some other areas. I've been to the Sierras. I've been to Yosemite. I've been to San Francisco, San Diego. I've not been to Los Angeles. And yet I'm looking forward to it. And yet I'm breaking out. Okay? Being on TV. Breaking out of my comfort zone. So what kind of things will be in store for you when you break out of your comfort zone. Your life is getting ready to expand. The expansion is together with each other, 
And there's a twofold thing that goes with this birthing process. It's the contraction and the expansion, just like with any birthing process. But those both serve to push you out of your comfort zones that have been there previously. Please book a session with me. You'll find that you like it. The link is below. I'm also offering a coupon until November 1st. Um, I call it energy, but you will look for the causal body session. And I do this over the internet. I also do it live and in person here in Chicago. So if you're in the Chicago area or you're traveling, reach out to me. Email me. If you're not sure what would be helpful for you, I can also feel that. Reach out at twinflamesmerge at gmail.com. You'll find my website, www.twinflamesmerge.com. I also have Instagram. I have Facebook. So if you want to follow me for more frequent updates, follow me on Instagram. And I hope you have a wonderful rest of the day. I hope that some of this moon energy and Venus energy combined with Saturn is not too weird for you. But honestly, it's a little bit weird. It just is. Okay? It's not bad for everyone. It's just weird. And so come and find out more. I'll be trying to put up more information more regularly. And thank you for subscribing. Thanks to everyone who has had a session with me. I've been very honored and privileged to be able to talk to you, meet you, meet you from all over the world. And most of all, to get to know you a bit. And to know your love story. Because everyone's got one. And no two stories are alike. They're as unique as you are. And when you break out of these comfort zones, lots of great things can happen. Those gifts that you're bringing, the things that you know, they can start to come to life. You may not know everything you have in you. And yeah, it's not, it's not always easy, but nor does it have to be very difficult. If you would like to help other people and you've been helped by these messages, which I've been doing since 2014, uh, please consider contributing, which does go to help to other people. Because I've already done several sessions for people who you know, may not have been able to do that. That's just, that's just a request, and it does help people. I do plan to do more with that. I plan to do more with that. This is going somewhere. Those of you who are starting here, you're not, you're not going to be lost in this. But some people are starting and more people are getting awakened in 2019. You're advancing. Some of you have to turn around and help some of those people out of their comfort zones. So come and find out. I hope to see quite a few of you in California. The information is on my website and down below, in the links down below. So thanks so much. Have a wonderful rest of the day. Let me find the thing here. Thank you. Bye.